To be an entrepreneur or not to be an entrepreneur? That is the question. So let's take a look at some of the reasons why you would want to embark on this exciting journey and why so many people today feel this is the only way to be making an income now and in the future. Hi, if you're new here, I'm Jamie Brown of The Hedge Teacher. This channel is about sharing some information to help build your financial intelligence and awareness around health and money matters. And I'm passionate about educating and inspiring people in wealth and wellness. You see, to be whole, you need your health with your wealth. Times have changed. There is a new type of money master in the world today. It is you. You have to get onto this new page into this new chapter and in this new book. It's a new way of thinking, of being and of understanding. Join me on this journey now. Why do you want to become an entrepreneur? So many people say they want to start a business one day. These one day entrepreneurs really have their own business as one day usually turns into I wish I had. This inability to take the plunge is generally not about their personality, but more to do with them thinking themselves out of it. For people who can see themselves operating their own business, usually do. And those who think it's too big and terrifying tend to never move forward. If you dream of being your own boss, being an entrepreneur, then here are some things that can help you do just that. Find new role models. This is an important part of beginning your career. Identify role models who have a successful business and learn by observing them and their companies from a distance. Choose three or four companies that you admire and like and follow their articles, blogs, Facebook, Twitter and LinkedIn posts. If they have ebooks and audiobooks, get into them too. With these, you'll see how their leadership styles and personalities have shaped the companies they run. Keep up with their news and what they share about their own experiences. A lot of one-day entrepreneurs get put off by the whole business side of things. They think the knowledge and skills needed to run a business is extremely complicated and the learning curves are too steep, but it is not. It's important to get information about this in the beginning and start slowly. It's not as hard as you think. In today's day and age, this information is at your fingertips, literally. You don't have to go to university to learn and understand this. One of the easiest ways to learn what it's like to be an entrepreneur is to go out and get to know someone in real life. Just normal people who are self-employed. Meet up with those who are doing something close to what you want to do. Then there's others that have successful businesses in a variety of different industries. The more diverse your study, the better it is. Ask them about useful meetings, groups or resources that they can introduce you to. You will soon find that you'll be thinking, well, if they can do this, so can I. There is a certain feeling you get when shopping in a small business. As a customer, there can be that special experience you get from a small or family-run business. It can be the connection you have with the staff and owner, or the attention to detail that is given to what they are selling, or the service they provide. In addition to making friends with them, it's also important to build a relationship with them. See what you like about them, or the products they offer that you love. What they do well, and what you think you could improve in your business. What was memorable, unique, and stood out for you. Think about your feelings and your experience as a customer, as this will give you lots of insights into running your own business. As you work on these areas, you'll find other ideas coming into your head faster and clearer than before. Start a journal, write these down before you forget them, and revisit your writings regularly to refresh your memory. 
The more and more you do this, the more your thoughts and ideas of being an entrepreneur come to you. You'll soon see that it's not as scary and daunting as you are thinking. And the one day can and will be with you sooner than you think. My question for today is, how soon do you want to be an entrepreneur? Let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know some of the subjects you'd like me to cover in the next few weeks. Until next time, this is Jamie Brown at The Hedge Teacher, educating, inspiring people in wealth and wellness. Don't keep this a secret. Like, subscribe and share this with your friends and family. If we don't hedge our own future, no one else will.